different pose, chat. It's a different pose. This is so crazy. Oh boy, here we go. Hi, um, um, want to give me some of those mushrooms? <laughs> She's like a real chunky. Uh, mm, want to give me some of those mushrooms? All right, it's back in. Wait. Back in why? Back in why? Here we go. Bleh. That just happened. See if I can drop kick this person. That didn't work. Okay. What is that? Come on. Oh, that wasn't the A button at all. Can't dodge that. Perform a killing blow when your opponent is knocked out. Close your eyes, chat. Gnarly. Oh, he, he did say what I thought he said. I love doing tutorials twice, chat. It's fun. Thank you for listening to this voice guidance system. Ah, finally waking up. You seem sleepy, so I turned it off. Huh? I'm talking about the Death Drive 128, of course, man. You were just playing it, remember? <laughs> hey, pretty cool, huh? Pretty badass. <laughs> it's the best game console ever, and this game, let it die. It's probably the greatest game ever made. Yeah! The goal of the game is pretty simple. Just make it to the top of the Tower of Barbs. It's like a hack and slash, roguelike kind of a thing. What the <laughs> Hey, dude, you're a gamer, aren't you? Then you'll totally be fine. Just try it out. I'll set it up for you. Here comes the bug. 
Okay, all ready to go? Let's get started! I'll start the game! Game scar, I guess. Let it die. Did I already do this? Get some deja vu, 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 vu. I got the butt crack again. I did do this. What's this? I'm scared to scroll, man. The hub of your adventure is this is the waiting room for the station bottom of the barbs. Last stop of line 15 situated under the tower barbs. This room contains many interesting features. To exit the game, return to the waiting room and select quit the game from the options menu. You can also exit from the title screen. Warning, close the game outside the waiting room will result in character untimely death, so be careful. Oh. Mushroom Club. The club. The shop opens after you uh, rescue the mushroom magistrate, owner of the shop. They will deal skill decals formed with the mushroom picker. Um, attaching decals to a fighter's body will benefit the players with various effects. There are many designs or functions. Once the skill decal is attached, if the fighter dies or if the skill decal is removed, it will disappear. You can buy skill decals with kill coins or death medals. You can sell skill decals in your possession. Since you can't get rid of them, you might as well sell those you have no use for. If you bring the bronze skill shroom, silver skill shroom, or gold skill shroom, the magistrate is seeking to store, is seeking to the store, she will trade them for skill decals. It's a lot of information, Jack. What's this? You encounter mushrooms in the game, so let's take a look at how to prepare them. You can cook mushrooms by grilling them. Select the mushroom in your possession you wish to grill while pressing the back and Y button to switch to throw mode. In this mode, you can grill the mushroom by approaching a fire or pressing A. Some mushrooms cannot be grilled. You can also just throw them into the fire to grill them. Their effects change when you grill them, so be experimental when cooking. There's a lot of information here. Blueprints, yeah, yeah. I'm assuming I can get back to these if I need to. Storage chests, okay, that's important. Store and take out, all right. Rewards box, all quest rewards are placed in this box. Okay. Gear elements. There are six types of gears. Slashing. Six types of equipment. Slashing, blunt, piercing, fire, lightning, and poison. You can hold up to two types of weapons at the same time. It's important to pay attention to the type of armor the enemy is wearing and manage your weapons accordingly. Armor has a defense value that varies with the type. It's important to pay attention to the enemy's weapon and switch accordingly. This is a service where Uncle Death will deliver the player presented. 
presence on this beloved death mobile free of charge. It's not just a login bonus. It's Uncle Prime. Upon leaving the waiting room after opening a box, another will be delivered to you. You'll be able to open this next box 20 hours after delivery. Express. Oh, whatever. So open it. I got a hammer. Let's break it. I need some pants, chat. Weird buzzing. Haptic feedback in progress. Um. That's about seven doors, I count. Okay, there we go. Jeez Louise. Look, there you are from before. The old you is nothing but a raging maniac now. You have to kill him before he kills you. Good thing I didn't name my character Buona. I still know how to block. I know how to dodge though. Oh boy. Oh boy. I can't move. I'm I'm stuck. A weapon Combos are weird. Cleveland, two months in a row. Thanks for hitting that reset button. Everybody, show some love in the chat. I just thought of something I need to do. I forgot I got to put the color thing. So you can move while blocking too. Pause. Guess not. <laughs> oh. Gather that soul. There we go. All right, let me do this while I'm thinking about it. Uh. <laughs> I'm not sure that the key in the window. Arf! Arf! 
We will put it in alerts. That'll make it easy. Um, add... Browser? Lumia, there we go. Lumia overlay. <laughs> wow, that's a... Uh, that's kind of blue. A um, little bit more blue than I would like. Um, a <laughs> little bit... A little bit more blue than I would like, chat. But I guess we're going to have a blue hue in all our games now if I do this. Thank you so much, Gorma Ball, for giving us up to Nyx Inferno. Everybody's showing some love in the chat. Thank you so much, man. Where is color correction? All right. So we're going we're gonna to throw some opaqueness on this like crazy. Like 15%. Thank you so much, man. Bono, why is your game blue? Because I ain't got no sense. All right. Uh, how do I equip this? A? Iron hammer. Oh, wait. There we go. That's how you do it. Yay, I got a weapon. Uh, what's this? Thank you, Grumble Ball, for that. Appreciate it, dude. Really do appreciate it. That takes us up to 440 sub points. Well on our way of 500 to the 500. Thank you, man. If your fighter exhausts their HP in the game, they will die and be resurrected as an enemy. When a fighter dies, they transform into an enemy roaming about the floor in which they meet their de demise. Such fighters are called haters. We, we need to have a talk about this. Chat. The fighters are called haters. What the heck? Um... Hello? I just got in this menu somehow and it's, I don't want to have to run the game again. I think I'm going to run it twice. I'm running the game twice, chat. I think. Dude, when I get out into that, that menu... Like, when I get in this thing, it's hard to... Like, we all tab out. It's really hard to get back in. Steam overlay. Okay. I need some pants! I'm gonna start hitting stuff until I get some pants. Like this. Give me that. Beasts. There are a great variety of creatures besides uh, enemies in this game. Now them are docile. Some will attack you while others will emit poison. Hey, it's a, it's a green boy. It's important that the player makes use of these beasts in order to survive. That's some monster hunter stuff. Did he say ditto ditto? Oh, this says something about mastery level. Is that a robot? Crap. Did 
You can level up in the waiting room, it says. It says. Ditto, ditto. Yeah, I need a mushroom. That's the only way I know you can heal. <laughs> Apparently, it's I need yoga. That's gonna be a thing, chat. Get used to it. Uh, I got a head. In life. There's a big delay there between blocking and attacking. Alright, we get that blocking. I'm trying to learn how to block, but nope. It's time to spam. We're dead. Grab the frogs. Oh, I thought they like blew up on you or something. Effect we need cure gas. Oh. I just go to the beginning again? I think I did. All right, Zero Frost. Have a good day, man. I'm 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 very confused by this game. There's a lot going on that I just don't understand. That's cool, but I did. Whoa, he hits really hard.
Uh, how do I change my... Never mind. I was like, how do I change my left weapon? Hit the left arrow. I broke my glasses the other day and it's the weekend, it's the thing. Oh man. He's saying ghetto ghetto. How you doing, Kurataki? Welcome. Fireworks launcher. Ooh. Put that on my right hand. All right, Impact, have a good night, man. Everybody's dropping off, going to bed. Thanks, everybody, for coming by tonight, man. All you do is hanging out, chilling with us. Have a good night. I'll see you all later. Thanks again for being here. I miss. I think that's a firework one. Tower Barbs features not only escalators, but elevators also, including the DS, DH Express Royale elevator. Uh, there is also a system of rare sub-elevators that run only between certain floors of the tower. For more information about DH Express, please read Barb's Bible, Volume 20, about DH services. Getting on and off, when you discover an elevator in the tower, turn the power switch on to allow the elevator to stop at that floor. Once you have done this, you can just use some kill coins to hop into the elevator anytime you wish to return to that floor. Using elevators to return to the waiting room uh, and refresh yourself completely is probably a good idea if you want the pleasant climb to the summit. Crap, I need to read the, the rest of that. So if I flip this power on, I'll be able to come back here? Is that how this works? If you access Mingo Head after returning to the waiting room via the escalator, you can use your XP to level up. What? But The door closed. I... Okay. Guess I'm going this way. How do I go back to the waiting room? It says you can go back to the waiting room, but I don't know how. Use the cage elevator. This one? Oh. Yeah. I had no clue. Wow. That's some sporadic movement you got there, boy. The gold elevator is premium. 